Alright, so you guys have most likely already seen or heard about this, or already know about this, but I just wanted to make a video about this because it is affecting me, and if you don't know what it is, to ho I made this video to hopefully educate you, inform you about this. So, I'm just basically going to read it off. It says, Starting today, we're changing the eligibility requirement for monetization to 4,000 hours of watch time within the past 12 months and 1,000 subscribers. We've arrived at these new thresholds. After thorough analysis and conversations with creators like you, they will allow us to significantly improve our ability to identify creators who contribute positively to the community and help drive more ad revenue to them and away from bad actors. These higher standards will also help us prevent potentially inappropriate videos from monetizing which can hurt revenue for everyone. What the heck? Um, so on February 20th, 2018, we'll also implement this threshold across existing channels on the platform to allow for a 30-day grace period on that date. Channels with fewer than 1,000 subs or 4,000 watch hours will no longer be able to earn money on YouTube. When they reach 1,000 subs and 4,000 watch hours, they will be automatically re-evaluated under strict criteria to ensure they comply with our policies. New channels will need to apply and their application will be evaluated when they hit these milestones. Man. And they even say right here, those these, though these changes will affect a significant number of channels, 99% of those affected were making less than $100 per year in the last year. Okay, that's true. Now this is affecting me because I do not have 1,000 subscribers <clears throat> yet. We're halfway there, which is freaking awesome. I don't know how I'm here. Even though most of my subscribers are inactive, let's not talk about that. But 4,000 hours of watch time in the past 12 months, 4,000 hours of watch time in the past 12 months, that's pretty hard to do. That's pretty hard to do for me. I'm going to show you guys my stats right here. Um, so this is my stats for last year, which is uh, 2017 from January 1st, 2017 to December 31st. Uh, my total watch time was 23 days and 21 hours. If you calculate that into hours, that's nowhere near 4,000 hours. So I'm definitely going to need to up my game. <clears throat> but yeah, I'm going to have to make longer videos and up my game. But right here, average view duration, a minute 46 seconds. What the heck, guys? Why are you guys leaving a minute and 46 seconds into the video? Watch the whole thing. This is just to show you my stats and how this is affecting me. In my opinion, I guess I have mixed feelings about it. I don't like it because I'm being affected, but then again, I was, I did think about other creators and them, like, them having a big following on one social media and just going over to YouTube and automatically have a following and make money. But that's just me. I mean, let me know what you guys think in the comments. I don't know about this. I mean, there's nothing I can do, but I'm going to have to deal with it, but I'm not going to give up. Definitely not going to give up. I'm still going to keep making videos for you guys. I am going to reach 1,000 subscribers. Hopefully, we can reach 1,000 subscribers by the end of 2018, if not sooner. I know that's a very, very big thing to ask, but I believe it's possible. Let's see if we can get 1,000 subs this year. I just wanted to make this quick video for you to tell you my opinion, what I feel about it. I want to, I want to hear, or I want to read your comments. I want to see what you guys have to say about it, your opinion. I know I'm pretty late to this, but I still made a video about it. Hopefully it's, it's it counts.